Good morning, welcome to Grounded Week 6. My name is Riley. Um, let's jump right in today with a reading from Deuteronomy 24, verse 19. When you reap the harvest in your field and you forget a sheaf in the field, do not go back to get it. It is to be left for the resident alien, the fatherless, and the widow, so that your God may bless you in all the work of your hands. What this verse is telling us is that when we have an abundance of gifts or blessings, we should share some with others who may not have, um, who may not be as fortunate as us. So in your life, this might look like taking a little bit of extra time every day to help out a neighbor in need or a family member. To remember that God is always asking us to be with others, we are going to be making a dried flower bookmark. To remember this lesson today, we're going to be creating uh, dried flower bookmarks. So to get started, you're going to need to find some flowers. You can buy a bouquet from the store or you can go outside and pick some. And you're going to take them and put them in a book and close the book and put something very heavy on top of it. Then you're going to leave it for two to three days and you'll end up with something that looks a little bit like this. So you're going to have lots of flowers to choose from. And then you're going to need to take some cardstock or cardboard and cut out a couple rectangles to use as your bookmark. You can only make one, that's totally fine. I just had extra, so I might make a few. And then what you're gonna do is with a parent's help, you're gonna take some hot glue and glue your flowers onto your cardboard. Once you've done this, you can take some paint, markers, or crayons and add your own personal touches. Um, so I will jump right back and show you what some of mine look like. I made that look like this, or I also made this one, which I put my name on. and. Um, I made multiple, you don't have to, you can only make one if that's what you want to do. And now every time you open up a book, you can remember to share your blessing. Finally today, um, if you've been following Grounded from week one, you may remember planting our seeds at the very beginning. So I just wanted to show you my plant. It's grown quite a bit um, since the last time I saw you. So now um, I know I have this beautiful plant to remember our lessons. And I also have these wonderful bookmarks. So I hope you guys really enjoyed the program. Have a wonderful rest of your week and a great Easter.